Hi everyone, it's Drink It Repeat. I am going to be going to Total Wine today to grab a couple of wines and one of them, Wine Guy Mike, is going to guess. And I am excited and maybe he will get it right. We'll see. went to Total Wine and I grabbed a wine for you. Um, okay. I'm hoping that you're gonna like it, okay. but I don't remember what it was, but <laughs> it's just too good. Cool. So I'm gonna do a blind tasting. <laughs> yes, I okay. mean completely blind because I don't remember what I got. So you want me to guess this wine, huh? What do you get? Well, my first guess, it's not a white wine. Oh yeah, it's red. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It just needs to breathe here a little bit more, but... Uh... Do you smell anything? I smell some fruit. It's like dark fruit. I smell cherries. Do you? Yeah. That's what it could be. Mm, that would be funny if that was um, what it was. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that would be the first. <laughs> I, I like it so far, whatever it is. I like this. This is a good choice. I think it, it would be better cold. Chilled a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit. I don't know how you like it this temperature. Does it need to breathe more? For me, it does. I think I just need more wine. <laughs> uh, we could do that. Mine's Want me pour? <laughs> <laughs> okay, my second guess is this wine is not from Italy. I even go so far as it's not from France. I don't know. But I, but <laughs> <laughs> but I definitely do like it though. Ah, this is getting better now. Okay. This needs to breathe, that's all. And this wine is not from Argentina or Chile. So how do you know that? Because I had some Chilean wines, I've had some Australian wine, or not us from Australia either. Okay. <laughs> I've had wines from each of those countries. It's not from Spain. So I'm definitely gonna say California. Okay. So the next question is, what's the grape? Hmm. But I think I need a refill. <laughs> I'm going to say it's not a Zinfandel and it's not a Pinot Noir. It's not a Merlot. So I'm going to guess it's a Cabernet Sauvignon. Okay. Am I right? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I have to unbag it. Unbag it. <laughs> Ready? Let's see how good I did. <laughs> Bam. Oh, wow, I'm surprised. Oh, but we did get the flavors of black cherry. And there's plum in there too. But this one is a uh, So I, I didn't get that one right. No. You didn't. But I did leave it the it was second that was said. <laughs> Where does it say it's from? It's from California. A corn um, wine company, California. Oh, okay. I see it. I see it. And this is, our, this is oh, Merlot. Oh, Napa. Okay. See, that's why I had to narrow down to the last two grapes, but but this is good. I like yeah. this. This is really good. Yeah. I think you did really well with guessing. <laughs> Lots of practice. Yeah. Lots of practice. I'll never get there. But. <laughs> so my question for you is, why did you chose this wine? Because of the duck on it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just be honest. <laughs> no, that's fine. I like it though. <laughs> so a couple of the other wines that I grabbed, um, grab this one because the bottle's really cool. You see how I do it? It's a uh, bourbon barrel aged. Mm. 
That looks interesting. And then this one might look oh. a little familiar to you. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so they did have that at Total Wine. Yes, but they didn't have the Southern Strawberry one that I like. Yes, so so, I'm not surprised. Yeah, but. But that is a good one. Mm -hmm. That was a very good wine. The Blueberry Moscato. Not gross. It's not dry. It goes down really smooth. It's nice. I think I like this one more than the first one, the duck horn, duck horn, you like it? Oh, this one's a little different. Yes, that was my first time at Total Wine. Really? And yeah, it's like so much alcohol. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> Like, yeah. I'm like a kid in the candy shop when I go there. I said, oh, that bottle looks good. Oh, that bottle looks good. Yeah. Oh, that bottle looks good. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we were just looking for wines, but I would definitely go there again if I wanted to, like, go and find, like, some beers or... Yep. Beers, too. or something. Because they, a lot of microbrews are in there. They mm -hmm. have, uh, you know, plus all the vodkas, gins, and whiskeys. Yeah. A very good selection of wine. I also liked how they listed, like they had, you know, employees' favorites. That was kind of yes, nice yes. to see. Yep. Now the fruit's coming out. Oh, the fruits? Yeah. Fruit. I'm not getting no fruits. Where's what fruit? I don't see any fruit. Yeah. I mean, this oh. one's good, but that one's better. Oh, smell it's getting better now. I think it was better already. <laughs> Wait, what am I doing? We're doing this one right here. It's oh, okay. called the. Uh, Blueberry yes. Moscato. Does this one look familiar to you guys? Yes? I don't know. I enjoy it. I really like it. I kind of get the blueberry a little bit. Yeah. Um, it does smell like barf, but... <laughs> it does smell like barf. It's... But it's really good. It's very sweet. I like it. Good. Yeah. That was a challenge. <laughs> it is. It's so much fun doing this and getting to pick out a wine surprise one guy Mike. If you have not already subscribed, please do. I enjoy doing these videos. They're so much fun and I'm looking forward to the next one. Thank you so much. Bye. That's a like. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> these are the reds and these are all the whites. Mm -hmm. So he was cheating. <laughs> All it has is just the names of grapes. That's all I had out here. And then it wasn't even a very good list because I had to add more. <laughs>